Matt, can you introduce us to these two guests you brought yeah, here? So uh, these are actually litter mates from the couple puppies that came a couple weeks ago. So I have Mirage and you have Vivian, yes. or Vivi <laughs> as you have nicknamed. What's up, Vivi? <laughs> But uh, they're 10 weeks old, <laughs> and uh, they came in on the 4th of July with their mom. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, they were found in a park here in Lincoln and came in. And so they weren't quite big enough to have surgery yet, like their litter mates. So they went to foster care for a couple weeks. Now they've been spayed, microchipped, got their initial vaccinations. And so now they're ready for their new homes. Oh. Are there any adoption promotions going on with that? So we still have the Mary Jo Livingston adoption promotion. So that's for cats five months and older. And so it doesn't apply obviously to these two, but uh, she's still sponsoring the adoption fees on those cats. So take advantage of it. You know, there's lots of uh, slightly older cats and slightly older kittens that are looking for homes and she's covering half that adoption fee. So you can't really beat that. I'm guessing they're going to be a little bit more rambunctious later on in life. <laughs> yeah, these two. They're yeah. pretty chill right now. Yeah, they're yeah. pretty chill right now. You know, they're uh, you know they got the puppy breath still. So uh, you know, yeah, once Bonus. they get a little bit older, you know, they'll get a little more rowdy, a little more rambunctious. But uh, you know, we think they're like shepherd collie mixes. Okay. Mom kind of looks more like a Australian shepherd mix. So it'll be interesting to see what they look like when they're full grown. Uh, mom's around 50 pounds, but uh, she has slightly older or longer hair and obviously they seem a little more shorter haired so be a very interesting mix when they're all full grown to say the least uh with the heat matt i we got 100 degrees coming up yeah. here and it's already 101 there on the heat index and malcolm's yep. got pulled up right yep. now it's just uh <laughs> what do you do with your pets in that in that scenario you know right now you know this week and even it sounds like into the weekend and early next week you know just keep them inside limit the time outside i mean you walk outside and it just hits you i mean so it's it's really hot obviously we all know that and so uh, keep the pets indoors, limit the time outside, limit the walks. Um, if you're going to do those walks, do them in the late evening um, or very early morning when it's a little, little mm -hmm. cooler and the concrete or asphalt isn't super hot. And uh, Get them some toys to play with inside, maybe some popsicles um, and keep them indoors and make sure they always have access to water and, and just don't take them in the cars. I mean, the cars heat up really, really fast and uh, don't leave them in the cars. A little puppuccino maybe. Puppuccino. Yeah. Puppuccinos, yeah, yeah. Or, or something <laughs> like that, you know. Bring them home, something from the, from the drive-through and uh, just keep them cool inside yeah. for sure. Treat them well. Uh, what about events happening in the community, specifically the one tomorrow night? Is there a fundraiser tomorrow night? Uh, the... Tomorrow night we have a food truck coming out to the That's adoption right. center um, and they're donating 20% of the oh, cool. uh, uh, proceeds from that. And so folks, <laughs> uh, you don't want to cook tomorrow night, you can come out to the adoption center. Uh, they'll be out there around five o'clock, so you can come on out and grab some uh, food for and help support pets at the shelter at the same time. How was the golf game last weekend? T Tales I didn't tees. get last. Well, that's good. Tied for 28th. 28th, so <laughs> nice. Out of 36, so uh, improvement, <laughs> but uh, it went really, really well. We had a great turnout, uh, 36 teams, and ended up raising over $32,000 to help uh, take care of the pets at the shelter, so we were really happy with uh, how it went. Right, awesome. Well, Vivian, Mirage, what do you think? You say goodbye? <laughs> no? All right. Well, I think Vivian wants to come home with me, but you know, she's really we'll see. Uh, we'll settled see. down there. No kidding. All right, all right. We'll be right back after the break. Everyone, please stay with us. See, I have the camera. Vivian, come on.